Hi everyone, it's Lee from Gnome and Backyard, and you asked for a quick video tutorial on how we painted our coffee lover gnome ornaments. Well, here it is. The first thing we did is we painted all of their feet chocolate brown and the hooks on top to match our hats. The second thing we did is we painted two of our beards white, and the third beard we used our brown wax. We wanted it to look uh, like a wood finish, so you can see it's a lot lighter than the paint would be. We did the same thing with that first hat that says coffee on it, and with the third hat that says lover, we did take the wax also, but we wiped it off with a baby wipe to get a real, real light color. Our hat in the middle, we painted pink. Of course, our noses, we painted flesh color, and then we had some fun with our coffee cups and our donut. Our one coffee cup, we painted it blue and gave it yellow polka dots. Our other coffee cup, we painted it purple with a little pink heart. And then, of course, our donut had to have sprinkles, and we painted sprinkles on our donut, which you'll see a little bit better in the end. Now, all we're doing right now is taking our instant glue, and we are gluing our beard layer on top of our base layer and now we are just gluing our hats on top of our beards this is a 3d project it looks really really sweet these are really cute if you have a tree in your kitchen or they look absolutely adorable hanging with twine on your coffee bar these cuties you can keep out all year round now here's my favorite part everybody knows that when we add the nose it really does look like a gnome how cute are they and then, of course, these little guys, they also have little hands that we painted flesh-colored. Each one needs a little hand to hold his coffee mug. And, of course, our little guy in the middle whose donut icing and sprinkles match his hat, he needs two hands to get a great grip on that donut. How cute is that little donut? Now, we did use a very fine paintbrush to get all those details. We hope you enjoyed this quick tutorial, and thank you so much for continuing to sprinkle all of Gnome and Backyard's videos. Here's a close-up of that donut that I promised. Look at those sprinkles. Boy, does that donut look good enough to eat. And don't forget, definitely personalize your little coffee mugs.